rolling na. Rolling na. Yeah. Sharing, how did you start your career as an accountant? Um, I started off as an audit, in audit, mm -hmm. and a junior auditor in Deloitte. So it's located in BGC. Mm -hmm. um, right after the results of the CPE board exams, mga two weeks after that, mm -hmm. they called, and ayon, sinunggaban ko na. Uh -huh. So November 2015, na ako nag-start my work done as um, an auditor and it runs at uh, one year and eight months upon the group and yes yeah. so you started in Deloitte mm -hmm. and uh, uh, how long did you work for Deloitte? one year and eight months okay. so during that time I handled around 10 to 15 clients uh -huh. uh, ranging from Metro Manila and the farthest client I've um, worked with is parang located in South Cotabato. So you you went to South Cotabato mm -hmm. then for that client. Yes. So being a fresh grad po, that was uh, uh, you you work na it, uh, you were working on the field. Mm -hmm. po, ano po yung challenges ano po yung, what's the experience? Of course, um, at first, parang uh, it's something new to you. It's something new to you. It's something new to me. So. Sabi ko, matay ko ba dito yung mga, mm -hmm. yung mga uh, natutunan ko during my undergrad. So, um, during that time naman, na, 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 parang nafe-feel ko na, na-differentiate ko na yung workplace versus school na vibe. And it's really different um, to work in um, to be in the outside world talaga, then rather um, consigned in the four corners of the classroom. It's more challenging, mm -hmm. but it develops you, um, it widens your perspective. Mm -hmm. It stretches you to become a better version of yourself. Mm -hmm. Can you please elaborate more yung sa, it's very different from the, from the school setup and sa real world yes. setup? Um, school setup, your you're parang more on theories, principles, facts, more on book, bookish na type. But then when you're working na, it's it's where you can apply those concepts and principles. Um, it's practical application na kung maga. And there, hindi lang pala hard skills yung kailangan. Um, soft skills are also indispensable when you get to interact and deal with clients more and jana the test yung time management skills mo din. So, uh, uh, being, being a fresh grad and mm -hmm. working for Deloitte, you have already uh, realized this and uh, this, uh, you, you were able to uh, from from this one set up to the real world. So after sa, sa Deloitte, you were working Sa current company mo na ikaw? Yes, it, actually this is my in current company ko is um, just my setup company. Mm -hmm. So, after a year and eight months, mm -hmm. I resigned and decided to go to a bank, to work in a bank. Mm -hmm. um, actually, yung pa one year na ako dito. dito. Mm -hmm. So, mga August 2017, mm -hmm. I worked there. Um, and, and, Actually, I'm dealing with um, stocks, valuations, fund accounting, where we get to um, value funds every day, daily. So we, um, measure confidential or measure ano yung work ngayon because it's, it deals with the stock, stock market every day. Yeah. Can you please ano na lang, uh, give us uh, the values that you uh, na practice mo sa with your current position in the company. Okay, um, generally, uh, being an accountant, na, um, what you must possess, um, you should know the importance or the value of client centricity. That's what I learned um, in my pre in my current company uh, because clients or customers are really the lifeblood of any business 
your company you're in, whether you're an employee or a businessman. So it dives the business. So when you're client centric, uh, you center on the client. So you must um, answer to their every needs, to their every demands. Pero syempre, um, you must learn to balance it then. Another would be one uh, hardworking and must be a keen observer then. Um, an accountant is very um, attentive when it comes to detail. We work around numbers all the time. So, kahit isang point zero one na discrepancy, the um, di ka uuwi pag di mo yan na na trace kung bakit ba this balance eh. Ayun. Um, yeah. I think that's um, that those are some of the values one must uh, no, possess. How about in integrity? What is your view? Um, integrity, of course. Um, every accountant, or not just accountant, but all professionals must possess that. Because it where it comes parang from within you, if you're if you have a good integrity, you have credibility. Mm -hmm. um, people look up to you. Mm -hmm. You're like um, you're like a role model sa kanila. And when you're looking at a more general social sense perspective, um, if all only has integrity, mm -hmm. if everyone has integrity, um, I think. Uh, we are currently living in a better, much more better place than what, where we are now. Do you think the accountants have integrity? We must. <laughs> you must. I, um, I want to be in a yes or no, but I want. I just want to uh, know that we must have integrity. Is it um, an oath, di ba? Yes. It's part of the oath. Ever, um, nung nakuha mo yung lisensya mo, you have parang encrypted into your senses na you must possess that kind of, oh no, of value. And not just dahil na, na parang, not just dahil in oath mo siya, but then look on the, look on the more general aspect. Um, and Pwede mo siya, you, you can bring along until the last days of your life, parang yan na. So, what's the content in your first choice in college? Actually, no. Um, it's business administration. Um, so, dami factors eh. First, um, when I graduated from high school, Lasalle, I heard that Lasalle offers um, one of the best uh, accountancy course. So one of the uh, cream of the crop ng tao nila dyan. So uh, I said to myself, now why not? Um, and ako kasi when I'm challenged, parang dyan ako na drive to parang get it on. <laughs> and then second, my mom is also a um, accountancy graduate, but then he didn't. Uh, she didn't pursue to take the CPA licensure exam. Noon kasi di pa uso yun daw. Pero okay na na naka graduate ka na. Actually, mami ko kanya din. Anya, daba. So sabi niya, ano? Why don't you take that course? Sabi niya, um, you've grown up naman. We, we've um grown you sa any business environment. Parang and you're good math. <laughs> You're good at analytical analysis, you know, analytical skills, you have analytical skills. So, I imagine my influence didn't say mom. So, I took up the course, and yeah. But, uh, how was not your first choice? Your first choice was business administration. administration. It was not my first choice, but I realized mm -hmm. that I did a, a, I chose the right option. Oh. No regrets. Uh -huh. So how was it uh, being an accountant, accountancy student, knowing that it was not your first choice? It was a bit, at first, in my first two years, I don't know, um, 
I take it as a prakay naman, kaya. But then, um, we were around 100 plus students at first, in first year. And then, during the second year, we took up the, um, anong tawag dyan? It's an exam, where, qualifying exam. And then after that time, um, na half siya. So, mga 50, around 40 to 50 students na lang. What happens to other 50? Um, they have the option to uh, shift to another course, which is management accounting. It's um, um we have the same curriculum, but then ayun, wala siyang board exam. Did you feel any pressure na uh, if, if if you're going to pass the qualifying exam? Yes, of course. Parang I pinagred ko yung sarili ko talaga. Basta I just studied hard. And how, how was the preparation? Um. Uh, years back, nasa library lang ako. Uh, every break, uh, I'll just eat my snacks or lunch quickly, just to have time sa library. Parang library yung hub ko. <laughs> House tsaka library yung hub ko during my college years. Kasi very challenging talaga yung pag-filter um, nila ng students taking up the, that course. Yeah. Where are you alone in? while you were studying or did you have a uh, like a study group like people who helping with 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 your with the uh, mm -hmm. with your um, studies? Your personality ko I have this personality that um I noticed na mas nakaka mas nakaka work ako or mas I'm being more productive when I'm alone. alone. <laughs> So I can work, I can study in groups, but more on ano na lang, yung nakabasa na ako. I mean, I have already studied, and then we'll just have a healthy question and answer portion. <laughs> yeah, just to test our uh, knowledge or kung nabasa mo na ba or you yeah. already learned from it. So, minsan, I study in groups, 